What's going on? It's yours. Truly just say it with me. They call me Miss Telefer. How y'all doing out there? So we're still seeing the impact of Takashi 6 ix agreed agreement to snitch and work with the feds. Uh, another member of the 9 trade gang found out how much time he'll do in, in federal prison. Back in April, Jamel Mel Murder Jones, a.k.a. the reported godfather of the 9 trade gang, he agreed to plead guilty to racketeering charges and a narcotic jar, charge uh, for his involvement in the 9 trade set and whatever he did. Now, we'll talk about Takashi in a second, but uh, Mel Murder found out that he'll be doing the next 135 months behind bars. That's 11 years and about three or so months. That's how much time he'll spend in federal prison. And he's also ordered to uh, five years of probation and to give up about $10,000. So he got hit super hard. Again, we'll talk about Takashi in a second. I do want to break down what the hell Mel Murder was proven guilty of. So pretty much Mel Murder was set up on a narcotics charge by a cooperating witness by the name of Christine Cruz. Uh, pretty much they set up Mel Murder to get some heroin to an undercover NYPD officer on November 15th of 2018. Uh, he, Mel Murder paid 10 grand for the, for the heroin. It was filmed. And Mel Murder was arrested. The racketeering charges because of his involvement in the nine trade gang. Specifically, what they have on Mel Murder is he was always around a lot of the crimes. And also they have that audio that, that was used in court, in which Mel Murder was on the phone with another rapper, ironically, Jim Jones. And in this conversation, Mel Murder does repeat to Jim Jones that uh Takashi 69 needs to get super violated. Uh, sooner rather than later. I'm summarizing, not quoting word for word. But yeah, it's, it's bad. It's a terrible situation. A lot of guys are going to do a lot of time behind bars. I mean, Mel Murder's 39 right now. So, I mean, he's looking at getting out around the age of 50. Uh, one thing Mel Murder did was write a letter to Judge Engelmeyer in attempts to get a second chance. He had his kids take the stand. I believe his daughter was on the stand and she was just pretty much saying, since my dad's been away, I've been depressed and down. I feel like I have no one in my corner to guide me. And and, and she was even like, yo, my little brother, I got a feeling he's going to go down a bad spiral and he's going to end up in the streets because his dad, Mel Murder, is going to be locked up. Can you please give my dad a second chance? The judge was like, look, your dad did a lot of bad things to some people and was involved in some crimes and some drugs. He's got to sit down for the next 11 years and some change. It's a very unfortunate situation, man. It's The reason why I bring up some of these minute details is because people are really impacted by this. Like, Takashi agreed to work with the feds. Again, that's his situation. Whatever he decided to do, it is what it is. But I just want him to realize you ain't just have your, – your fight is not just going to be – with members of the nine trade gang, like you got people on the outside who are affected by your decision, a rat snitch, your family's affected by this. And also these dudes will get out. And I'm sure not a day is going to go by where they don't think about you and anyone else who agreed to work with the feds, the names they can get their hands on. They're going to think about that every day for the next decade. You're going to be on their mind. So when you try to move on with your career, you can try to become a successful rapper again. And your mind is on other things and business and all that stuff and your music. Their minds are going to be focused every day on you. That is a very bold decision to make the snitch. And I hope 6 9 is willing to deal with the consequences of that. That's all I'm saying. Thank you guys so much for the time, love, support. I don't take it for granted. Mel Murder finds out that he has to do the next 11 years and a quarter behind bars. I'm out. I came from nothing, but I want everything God has for me. I interview celebrities. I talk sports. I still represent the coach. I got the kids. They tuned in. in. Tuned in. We locked in right now, Mr. Telefair. Mr. Telefair. Telefair. Shout out to Mr. Telefair. You watching Mr. Telefair TV. Mr. Telefair TV.